Sekiro. Sekiro. All I can hear is the, uh, when I start crouching like this, all I can think of is the goddamn ending of, um, the final boss of Sekiro, that's all. <sighs> okay, we're... Reduce the damage done... But increase the bonus damage? I don't see how. It will also give us Storm Stomp instead of Square Off. It will now then be a quality longsword. I'm kind of happy with what I have. Mm. Flesh. Yes, exactly what I want staining my pockets. Thank you. The truth was in the way. Thank you. As was that bugger. So yeah, if the horse, my mount can die, but it just costs a flask to respawn it. So that's not too punishing. There's a punishment there, but it's not too bad. I'm crouching there. You're a Kodomo and to die to your own goddamn ogre. Outside of its range of operation, but no. I've already killed it once, so I'll give me a chunk of souls, runes. Uh, I'm not fighting again just yet.
golden seed. Bouncy tree. That's a shaggier wolf. Down you go. Some tin beast bones and another tingy. Concern. Oh, great, there's even more. And it looks like it's full of eggs. Is it infested or does it just look fucked up inherently? Disengaging. Didn't seem quite as far, but I didn't think I could go back up, so... You can double jump. What the? Oh, 
Or it's also as soon as tank is expected. Oh, steed. Steed does not necessarily mean horse. Often is, but does, is not intrinsically associated. I'm back. Ah, hey. Managed Sorry to... about that. <laughs> no worries. Managed to actually kill the enemy. Oh, congratulations! He respawns. Ah, uh, fuck. Uh, so, yeah. He just also... You should have led with that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I should have. Uh, so... Uh, uh, but well done. Ooh! Fucking wolf. They pushed me off the goddamn edge here. Well, I suppose I'll be fitting. I pushed its leader off. Yeah, well, still. That should make you the new leader. Yes. I killed them all first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm up. I'm not used to having to jump like this in a Dark Souls game. <laughs> I mean, most of them, it's, there's no real like, jumping to them. There may be a like, run and jump, but nothing like that. Yeah. Because uh, you have to do, a, like in most games, you have to do, a, uh, most of them, you have to do a run a run up and then like, double click to jump. Yeah. Uh, so, But here you can just jump independently. Mm. So, different uh, range of movement. Right. Like, see there, that's the Shaggier Wolf. Okay. It's their leader. Also knows how to take a hit. Hmm. This oh. guy does not look very happy. Oh, God, no. <laughs> he can also take six hits, apparently. Okay. Compared to its colleagues, too. Damn. Job done. Uh, still you left. Bye bye. <laughs> uh. Oh, and uh, remember the giant I fought down there? Look, yeah. look over there. See that thing right out over my head? Yeah. Two more. Oh no. Oh yes. Oh no. Also, look at this thing. This thing's weird. Yeah. What is it? No idea. I'm sort of killing these, but no idea what it, what it is. It's freaky. Isn't it? And you haven't seen the worst bit of it yet. I don't want to. It's already giving me the willies. <laughs> it's gonna. Get... It's got tentacles. It's good for that. Oh stop! Come on, you gonna do it? No, that's not it. There we go! Isn't that all sorts of fucked up? Yes, and some. Yeah, I'm leaving. I'm not able to fight it. Oh, these things are here. Nothing. Uh, these things are... actually explosive. <laughs> they kind of look like something else. Crap. Something else. Oh, anal beads. Yes. <laughs> you can just say that. Oh, I didn't want to. It's not my video. <laughs> Tr true, I suppose. Because... <sighs> Like, my mouth can go from saint to slut in a second, so it's just best I 
mute Stay. myself. <laughs> True enough. True <laughs> enough. People just aren't ready for that. No. You know. They really aren't. They're not, no. They think they are, but they're not. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> uh, seeing the ghosts of the players running around is just throwing yeah. me constantly. Like, that's another player yeah. running around at, right now playing. Right. So... Also, you don't have to play online with other players. You could turn that off, I think. Okay. But it's it's kind of part of the thing, so I leave it on. It's not good. it's not like you get invaded too much yeah. in in these. But I suppose this is the closest one I played to launch, so that might be might change things up. Yeah. More people playing and whatnot. Just so you know, mm -hmm. dinner is on. Oh, is it? It is. Perfect. I was actually thinking about asking for that. <laughs> See? I'm always ahead of the game. Indeed. <laughs> he roared, boosting his own stats. I need to move off and heal. Tumbleweed, smeared in butter, mum, go. Okay, I'm just gonna keep just hitting him and just forget about trying to actually block these hits. You could at least give me your sword, damn you. Ambush this guy. With this crouching mechanic and like creeping up on enemies, like yeah. I, I suddenly feel like I'm playing Sekiro again. Because <laughs> I did it, that. It, yeah, it reminds me of it. Well, it is done by the same developers. There you go. So, they didn't have this in the other two games. You don't see me. Well, the, uh, in any of the Dark Souls games or Bloodborne, they didn't have it, but they yeah. they brought it in from Sekiro, so it, it, it feels very weird. Yeah. I'm gonna disengage. Stop crouching. And over here, yes, there's a um, side of lost glory. Okay. Oh, grace, whatever. Don't want to die and have to run all the way back up through the big guy and whatnot. And yeah, that's just asking to lose stuff. So I now have an extra charge for my flask. <laughs> I got a golden seed. Did forget okay. to read its flavor text. I also ha I can change my ability on my tenure. Oh, that's cool. Uh, I ca if I change it, I can't change it back, but it's called Storm Stump. Right. It seems like it will actually reduce the damage I do here for some reason, which is annoying, but it will give me the ability to do Storm Stump, which... Who knows what that does? Yeah. But, um. I'm gonna leave it as is. Because I'm, I'm liking the equipment I currently have. I don't want to ruin anything. Yeah. Okay, there's a person. Ooh, another stone sword key. Everyone who came with me. 
They crossed the sea for me, they fought for me. <laughs> Only to have their arms taken, their legs taken, even their heads taken. Taken and stuck to the spider. Did you know, if you're grafted by the spider, you become a chrysalid? It's quite a lark when you think about it. And uh, since we saw someone doing a new gesture, we now learn it too. Okay. So we can sit That's like cool. so we can sit like that now if we want. Right. If I uh, I don't know how to bring up the emote emotion uh, gesture menu, so. So I'm not sure how to change these, but uh, you, ooh, switch. There we go. Sitting settings. So, see, I can do this now. Oh, that's cool. So, like, there's no actual talking in the game, be it uh, voice over IP or text. This is how you interact with other players. Okay. You bow, you wave, you taunt. So, yeah. That's cool. And here's me just sitting like this. <laughs> so. Well, you look very comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. No. <laughs> You're all on your own, are you? And heading to Stormvale Castle. Enticed by the one in the white mask, I suppose. Oh, you've come to be one? The spider? Well, that makes us two peas in a pod. But I don't have your courage. It's scary, you know, having your arms cut off. Or legs. Or your head. I want to be like everyone else, but I'm just too scared. I'm nothing but a craven. The spider she's referring to is the very first boss of the game. Okay. You, you go in, you, you're walking around, and suddenly it just flings itself up into the sky and it slams down. She calls <laughs> it a spider. It's just this mass of just stolen arms and legs. Yeah. And heads. It's, it's, it's not nice looking. Oh, I know. Can you take this little one along with you? Spirit Jellyfish Ashes. Someone braver than myself. And the spirits look rather fondly upon you. They'll be glad of your company, I think, the little one. When, uh, with a spirit calling bell, you can use ashes to summon various spirits. Summoning typically consumes FP, only one summon at a time, and you can't summon spirits during multiplayer. I don't have a bell, sadly. It was a pleasure to see you. Oh. Can you pass on a message for me? If you see the little chrysalids in Stormvale Castle, tell them I love them. And that, despite my craven heart, I'm sure I'll be joining their club soon enough. I'm finally getting the hang of this whole pain thing, you know? It was a pleasure to oh, tell them I love them. I'm finally getting the hang. Okay, it seems to be plan she seems to be planning on getting grafted. Oh. Have fun. I'm planning on shanking the thing, so, you know, <laughs> different strokes. Hmm. No, I can take these. Maybe, oh, f four of them at once is a bit much, but oh well. Don't underestimate them flailing. It's, uh... You get kind of staggered, and it does a lot of damage. Yeah. But you like, the, you like this game, anyway. Uh, yeah, I do. But yeah, it's, there's no difficulty settings to it. It is what it is. Yeah. 
So, um, as much as I'd like to see you try it and, like, I manage to beat it, it wouldn't be an easy affair. Yeah, I don't think it's for me. And that's fair. Not everyone is, and... Yeah. It's... Like, I like it, I'd like to give it a go, but I don't think it's a me game. Hmm? Maybe I'll be surprised. Maybe. You could always give it a try via the, um... Damn you. Um... Sorry, he summoned everyone. But you could always... Uh, it should be shareable on Steam. Yeah. So you could give it a try, a try on my copy. Yeah. I might. Sword, sword, sword. Ah, not gauntlets. Damn you. But yeah, you can always try my copy and give it a go that way. That way you don't have to spend, Thank you. you know, 48 quid on it or 60. Yeah, uh, I wouldn't be spending that. You know what I spend on games. <laughs> yeah, 20 or less. <laughs> a 20 at the very mostest. Yeah, it's more like a 10 or less. <laughs> yeah. Uh... So. Ooh. Ow. Where's the? And this guy, completely oblivious. <laughs> oh. Actually, I had my head stuck up his ass and he didn't even notice. God's sake. Can't interact with that. Oh, this is reassuring. Turn up web pools from players. And, ooh, if we interact with this, we can see how they died. Ooh. Not that these are giving too much detail. Hmm. Maybe chariot. Hmm. Oh, there's a gray site here. Um... Just like looking at the route here, it was make me think of a Dark Souls 2 boss, though it's a lot narrower. Uh, it's this arena, and it's it's like skeleton on the chariot, which pulled by skeletal uh, horses. Right. And you have to make your way around the arena, killing uh, killing off necromancers and closing get and to close the gates to the far end. So when they slam mm -hmm. into it, it you will fight the actual boss, the horses, not the guy right. riding the chariot. Yeah. So, well, the horse. You kill that and the uh, boss fight done. But, yeah, this made me think of just... Uh, well, given okay. the amount of deaths here, I thought there was going to be a, bo a powerful enemy in this little corridor. Yeah. And then I was getting fears of that. Oh. There's a boss right ahead. And this gold summon sign. I'm just gonna look this up. This could be an NPC. Mm. Uh, in some of the games, they kind of 
people are to gather to summon signs. Alright. Uh, they appear in gold. Okay. Um, basically, you can summon players to help you fight bosses, but you can also summon NPCs. Okay. Um, but in the previous game, the NPCs, like summon signs, were pretty much identical except for Solaire, who stood out. Alright. Uh, but here, NPCs are all gold. Okay. They do make enemies stronger, give them more health and whatnot as a balancing thing, but they can still be very useful. Okay. Get? Mm, fitting name. Wow, Sorcerer's got some nice moves. Also knows how to take it. Curious if we can't sever this tail. Yeah. Uh, a lot of bosses in Dark Souls 1 will actually sever tails. Okay. Um, and you get a weapon for it. But uh, it just has to be paranoid now. Yeah. And Sorcerer is dead. Bonus health that the boss has still remains. Damn it. Didn't get to take advantage of me staggering him there. Damn it. He's also a lot more talkative than so much. A lot more talkative than most, like, other bosses. Yeah. Like, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they talked a bit in Sekiro, certainly, but in Dark Souls 3, 1, 2, and 3, they didn't talk too much. Right. They, like, some did, but that was, you know, few and far between kind of deal. Mm. Uh. Uh. We'll try again. I don't need to summon him, I just feel like it. Okay. There we go. Hey. Jesus, I went in here with far too much souls. I didn't realize how many I had on me. And I'm no way out. No way to teleport. If I want to keep these souls, I have to win this fight. Okay.
Ooh. Gotcha. Do not does heavy damage. Okay. Okay, this guy is actually pretty cool. Yeah. I really miss um, my spells and stuff. You can spec for magic if you want. Right. You, you, like you can be like, ooh, hold on. Uh, like I'm going sword and board. Well, I'm going two handed right now. Yeah. But you could go have a bow. You could have a crossbow. You can use different types of magic, both divine and arcane. Okay. And you could say build yourself as a holy knight. You could combo it. Ooh. So you could have a sword in one hand and a shield in the other and switch out the shield so you can cast the healing spell and go back to your shield. Oh, that sounds good. You get that sounds cool. You get great customization. If I bring up this... Uh, sorry, I did cut you off there a little. Apologies. No, no. Uh, see, here's memory slots. These are... Yeah. Uh, you have to learn spells and you store them in these slots. So you can swap okay. them out at these uh, sites as you want. Okay, that's cool. And see all these stats here. Yeah. Um, these determined stuff over here. And fate and arcane intelligence, these are, will be presumably tied in with your casting ability. Right. Intelligence will probably be general casting, with fate and arcane meaning maybe, um, like, um, your divine versus your arcane spells. Yeah. I'll just get to explanations. Uh, no, actually, uh, affects, uh, also affects holy defense, vitality, certain sorceries, and incantations. Hmm. Actually, okay. no, it's intelligence uh, boosts... Uh, it's required to perform gleamstone sorceries. also boosts the power of intelligence casting sorceries and improves magic resistance. Well, this is for incantations. This works, Arcane works for both, it's some of both of them. Okay. So, you can build your character, you've got great like, versatility in how you build a character. Yeah. Um, well, that's good. It's, um, you aren't just stuck being as my, my character is, you can build yeah. it as you want. Okay, I like that. Uh, it just becomes down to getting enough runes to upgrade your character in that direction. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, That's cool. Mm. And uh, as I you... I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, no worries. I'm uh, happy now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you might I find... Mean, huh? You might find some fun to it, you know? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Uh, uh, you're going to have to wrap this up very quick. Okay, I'll just take one last shot at Git over here, and, uh... Yeah. You know what? We'll try it without the sorcerer. Gitty will be a little weaker for it. I won't have a companion to help. But that's fine. Yeah. Mine. I'm not sure if he gets bonus damage, but he would get bonus health. I tried to heal when he threw the knife, so it, it backfired. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah. I should not... I, I realized it was a boss fight. I should have went back and spent my souls. I did not realize I had so goddamn much on me. Yeah. 
one last time. Sorry. You gotta go. Um, well, that was just the alarm. Ah. So yeah, I'll, I'll duck in a second. Oop. Should have healed. I was just playing far too aggressively. Yeah, I can get that. I can get that. But yeah, if I want to save these souls, I'm gonna have to keep trying, Margit. But thankfully, the bonfire yeah. is literally right here. So if I die, I can just run right back in. Okay. The only way I can lose the souls now if, is if he kills me before I get them back. Okay. Which does. I'm gonna, I'm gonna love you and leave you. Sure. And uh, when you're done here, come on down. Sure, I'll just do this one last time. Ah! Yep. Tail attack. No bother. Bye, folks. No. Hmm, bit soon. Got fancy moves, head boy. Foolish ambitions to rest. I'm actually quite tempted in trying not in in doing it without assistance now. Boss, uh. I'm not sure if Elden Ring mimics Dark Souls 2 at all, but doing it without a, uh, an NPC for assistance, well, we can ruin NPC quests. Like, look at Lucatil. Or the other guy. That would have been hysterical. I'm gonna call it here. I'll talk to you again soon. Till then, till then.